Right. Well, last week, the president had announced that he would dissolve the Higher Judicial Council, which is the body responsible for uh, appointing um, uh, judges and uh, um, uh, naming judges. Um, this is the decree that actually dissolves that uh, body uh, and puts a new temporary one that he has, uh, the decree calls it temporary. We've seen several temporary decrees uh, since uh, the president dis dismissed parliament last July that have um, lasted for, for much longer than people had expected. So there's a question mark over whether this is indeed uh, temporary. Uh, as a response this week, we saw actually uh, judges going on strike, um, saying that they, they would like, they see it as an attack on the independence of the judiciary. Uh, this new decree decree basically uh, does give the president uh, greater direct control over the naming of judges in this higher judicial council, this new temporary one. Uh, but it's unclear exactly how this will be executed in practice. Now, Fadil, a lot of these moves have drawn international condemnation. Um, how is opposition in Tunisia reacting? Well, the biggest opposition group so far has been the Anahda Party, uh, although there's certainly several others. Um, they had called for a demonstration actually last week before this was announced. Um, they had postponed it to this week. Uh, and now the, the meaning of the demonstration currently in downtown Tunis, there's a, a, at least a, a couple thousand people who are there demonstrating, um, mostly from the Anahda Party, but from other uh, political parties that have joined them as well, um, basically saying that uh, uh, what they have been saying for months, which is that this is a coup, this is one more step uh, in uh, President Qais Syed's um, uh, uh, concentration of powers. Um, that said, uh, Qais Syed's supporters have actually um, supported the move, saying that this is a, a necessary cleansing of the judiciary, which he has accused uh, of being corrupt. Uh, but certainly there's also uh, international actors who have also voiced concern over this move, uh, with uh, 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 different actors releasing statements this week on uh, their concerns about uh, Qais Syed's latest step uh, on the judiciary.